Hey guys, it's Monique with EMG TV. Today I'm going to show you an easy mod to install an active accessory into your EMG passive pickup set. We get a lot of questions asking if you can use our active accessories with our passive pickups. The answer is yes, and it's completely solderless. I'm going to show you how to swap out your tone pot for an active boost, the AB220. The AB220 is like our original afterburner, but it has two detents. The first at 8 dB, second at 15 dB, and then you can crank it all the way up to 20 dB. It's like having a boost pedal in your guitar. The only tools you'll need for this install are a Phillips head screwdriver and a wrench. Today I'm going to be using the EMG hex driver, available at emgpickups.com. I have here an LTD Eclipse loaded with the EMG passive H1As, two volume pots, a passive tone pot, and a mono output jack. I'm going to replace the passive tone pot with the AB220 and the mono output jack with the stereo output jack. So now I'm going to install the stereo output jack, which acts as an on-off switch for your guitar. When unplugged, the battery will be off. This allows for over a thousand hours of playing time on just one 9-volt battery. Most guitars have space in the control cavity for a 9-volt battery, but in this case we've already got a battery compartment routed. I'm going to route the battery cable through the battery compartment. and then connect it to the output jack. And then connect the battery. I've already gone ahead and swapped out the passive tone pot for the AB220. Now I'm gonna connect it to the output on the EMG bus. So I'm gonna take one of the quick connect cables and insert it here, the arrow facing up, and connect it to the AB220. Usually we install these with the arrows facing up. But with our active accessories, I'm going to install these with the arrows facing down. So now I'm going to install the output jack onto the AB220. The arrows should be facing up. And then I'm going to install the power cable. Now that we've finished, we're going to do a quick strum test to make sure that everything was installed properly. You need to plug your guitar into an amp using any quarter-inch standard cable. Today I'm using the EMG Vovox cable, available at emgpickups.com. You should hear the volume go up incrementally with each turn of the AB220. I'm going to start at zero so you can hear what I'm talking about. Here it is at the first detent at 8 dB. Here it is at the second detent at 15 dB. And here it is cranked all the way up to 20. Now you're ready to play with your new Active Boost, the AB220. I'm Monique with EMG TV, and for more information, go to emgpickups.com. Thanks for watching.